My name is Sam Gandy. I'm a professor of neurology and psychiatry at the Mount Sinai School of Medicine in New York. I hold the Mount Sinai Chair in Alzheimer's Research, and I'm director of the Center for Cognitive Health and NFL Neurological Care. I was interested in biology and chemistry um, in high school and in Chesterfield and used that uh, together with my sort of long exposure to, to uh, how pharmacies operate to leave uh, Chesterfield with the intent of becoming a, a board certified pharmacist. So my exposure to Alzheimer's disease came during much of my childhood. Uh, when my father's mother developed a dementia, which I assume was Alzheimer's disease, uh, and spent many years uh, in a nursing home. Uh, we visited her every Sunday. She never recognized me, uh, even after the, the initial uh, diagnosis. So I uh, really became committed to Alzheimer's research in 1986. My initial experiment was to see whether the, the material that builds up in, in Alzheimer's disease, uh, called amyloid, has these chemical modifications, this attachment of phosphate to it. Uh, and we did some preliminary experiments and that looked very exciting. Then we went on and, and sort of as a second uh, step, looked to see if we could prove that this experiment we'd done in a test tube had any impact in living cells. And it did. And that was the first example of a way to regulate the uh, catabolism, the breakdown of amyloid uh, that was ever, had ever been described. We know now that there are genes that seem to at least initiate the process. Um, and they begin the changes in pathology, the changes in the structure of the brain, perhaps as long as 30 years before the first symptom. That's something we've only learned in the past three or four years. Probably the single most important thing in my career is to have gotten the right advice at the right time. And the first example of that was at Baptist College at, at CSU um, with Dr. Bonnet. When he recognized that um, I might want to set my goals a little more, uh, a little higher uh, and aspire to something, uh, to a more challenging career. I think that's probably the single most important thing is to find the right mentor, find someone who's interested in you, whom you trust, uh, and whom you can be candid with and say, you know, I really like this or that, and, and have someone who uh, can help guide you. I only now sort of look back to see where the, you know, where the main um, uh, turning points were in my career, and having gone to, to uh, Charleston Southern, it was really the first thing that got me to where I am now.